exotic Adrian. And Adrian, uh, you know, we were just saying this has got to be a little unusual for you with the roles reversed. It's, uh, it's wonderful to see you again, Joe. Good seeing you, Exotic. And uh, right now, in the ring, we've got Debbie Combs and Miss Linda. And we were just saying, Miss Linda has really come on in the past year or so to be one of the top ladies wrestlers in the world. And I've got to believe that the Exotic one had something to do with that. There must be a lot of hours spent training, Miss Linda. Oh, Linda is my one and only uh, pupil. I've never taught anybody. You'll, you'll see quite a few uh, European moves. Coming, uh, coming from Miss uh, Miss Linda. Well, now are we going to see some of those famous exotic Adrian Street moves that we see in the ring a lot? Uh, is she going? Is she going to be going up and kissing Debbie Combs or any of that? <laughs> I mean, you know, um, this is what we're used to seeing from exotic Adrian Street. I don't think she'd kiss uh, Debbie Combs. I'm I, sure I, can't I wouldn't. Say I blame her. I, I'm sure I wouldn't <laughs> like to. Right now, look at this. Now, Ooh. that's that's the kind of move, and she did not have the hair. Now, Debbie Combs is claiming that Linda pulled her hair. That was as clean a move as you will see in wrestling. Obviously, uh, Debbie Combs a little embarrassed by being taken over like that, and now she's trying to claim that she pulled her trunks. Yes, I think Linda, I think Miss Linda would probably prefer to kick her than kiss her. <laughs> All right, they tap in the middle of the ring, a headlock from Debbie Combs on Miss Linda. And as you can see, and uh, Bonnie, you made the, the comment, lots of hair in the ring right That's now. That's right, blonde and black, Joe. All right, Debbie Combs having Miss Linda down now, using the headlock. And uh, Adrian, as you can see, she's laying on top of Linda as well to put more pressure on this headlock. And look down. There, that's got to be some of the training we've, we're talking about. Linda used that forearm to uh, back her off and literally make her get up. Yes, leverage is what it's all about. I've taught, I've drummed that into Linda again and again and again. It's... Now there we saw hair. There we saw Debbie Combs grab the hair of Miss Linda and bring her over. So, uh, you know, I, I guess we see the type of person that Debbie Combs uh, is known to be. And right now, she is wearing that. Oh, good move by Miss Linda, though. She pulls her over. She's got her now. Got those leg scissors on her on Debbie Combs. And, uh, Adrian, let me ask you a question. Does it make it a little bit tougher to get out of a hole like this for a woman with, all, with the hair and everything? Does that make it a little bit tougher to kick out of a leg scissors than, than say, for a man? I can uh, answer that with experience. Yes, it is tough to get out <laughs> if you've got a lot of hair. Right there, close up on the beautiful Miss Linda. And uh, really, Adrian, I've got to tell you from a personal standpoint, it's exciting to see Miss Linda in the ring and to see her wrestling. I know, uh, you know, for years uh, we knew her as your valet, and she still, I know, comes to the ring with you. But to see her in the ring like this as a competitor and to be one of the top uh, female competitors in the world today must also be uh, very pleasing to you. Well, it's, it's very nice of you to say so, uh, Joe. It shows that you've got uh, excellent taste. And uh, yes, you know, we, we spend a lot of time, in actual fact, we're spotting each other in the gym. Uh -huh. Linda's, um, Linda, uh, well, she's well and truly recovered from a very badly broken ankle. And she's actually squatting with about uh, 215 pounds now. She's getting a few reps out with that. Very good. And uh, she's bench pressing about 185. Let me say. Very good for a girl. From a female standpoint, that is a lot of weight, Adrian, for a lady. Yes. Right now, we see Debbie Combs. A lot of this match taking place right in the middle of the ring. Great action for our wrestling fans. And we see some of the fans there. Debbie Combs takes Miss Linda into the corner. A big forearm right there into the uh, chest. Throws her into the other corner. Goes after her. And Miss Linda is waiting for her. Double boots to the chest of Debbie Combs. Pulls her down. Has her. Now, what's she going to do here? Oh, a big shot move. Oh. That has to be devastating for a woman, Adrian. And here we go again. She's going to do it again. Right. Oh. It's devastating for a woman, Joe. And I never, I never actually saw it do a guy any favors. Yeah, that's, well, that's, that's true, Adrian. I would imagine. <laughs> Right now, a good step over by Miss Linda, and she's really putting the pressure. Drops down now, and Adrian, if I understand, uh, this this tight move now, when she drops down like that, puts pressure not only on the knee, but the way she's holding it, also on the ankle. So she's putting pressure on the knee and the ankle at this point. Yeah, yeah, it's a good stretch, a good stretch on the uh, hamstring there, and um, if 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 she'll do so. If... Oh, look at that move! That's one of my favorite moves. Look at that. That's the European style you were telling us about. It's, it's the European style. 
I don't use it as extensively out here in, in the States as I'd like to, owing to the fact that some of the uh, wrestlers out here are so large that it's hard that to flip them on over. Yeah. Barney, have you ever seen that move before? That's the first time, Miss Linda, is, that's the first time I've seen it used here. A very effective move, Joe, and let me tell you, the fans here tonight in our TV studios are really behind Miss Linda. That's true, they're cheering her on. Uh, Adrian, going back to that move, I mean, it just, to me, uh, the pressure on the ankle uh, and on the hamstring, like you said, and on the knee, but then the move ends up with the woman actually being slammed back to the mat again. Absolutely, and, and the thing is, if she, tries, if she tries to resist at all, if she tries to resist that impetus... I say she's stalling, but she's not real anxious to get back in either, I might add. Now, she's climbing in very slowly, and it's... Oh, it's oh. to her detriment, because look at this now. Miss Linda has Debbie Combs turned upside down in the ropes and is giving her what we would call where I'm from a good old-fashioned spanking. Well deserved I think by Miss Combs. turning the other cheek. Oh, turning the other cheek. I like that. Debbie runs right now. Miss Linda trying to get uh, Debbie back into the ring. And, uh, Adrian, this has to be a little bit upsetting for a wrestler to have their opponent stalling like that because Miss Linda has her adrenaline going. She had a, a good uh, moves going everything. And to have the opponent stall... Uh, does it sort of bring you down a little bit, having to wait? Oh, that can be really infuriating. And, you know, very often they'll try to go the outside, to, try to go the outside the ring. To get you actually to come yeah, outside. And the, the, there's um, a tactic amongst that, that type, but, you know, you, you, if, if you get yourself too excited, I've told Linda to just to sort of count to ten and, and keep calm when I do that kind of thing, because you can chase them outside the ring, they'll dive back in, when you follow them, then you're really vulnerable, right? Well, right now, Miss Linda having the upper hand. Debbie Combs now grabs Linda, brings her up in a uh, what could be an airplane spin here. And, yes, she's going into an airplane spin. Now, this is a very volatile situation for Miss Linda. And most of the time, we'll see a pin after. Well, we almost saw a pin, but not the one we expected. Miss Linda handled that very well. And as uh, Debbie Combs took her down, turned it into her advantage. Linda into the ropes now. Goes over the top, brings Debbie over, though. One. Two, that's two times in just the past few seconds we've seen a near pin here on Flair. Miss Linda now taking over. Debbie Combs, and there we see the use of the hair again. A drop kick right to the chest and the throat. Debbie goes down. There's a one, two. Miss Linda kicks out. And you can tell that all of the action in this match is beginning to take its toll on both of these ladies and Bonnie. We're seeing some of the uh, finest, you might say some of the hardest wrestling we've seen here on Flair coming from these two uh, ladies. And I guess that's what you'd expect from the, these two. The ladies of Flair, oh, yes, Look at this now, almost again. Ooh, and uh, you know, our referee Jose really taking his time to stay out of these ladies' way as they are very agile and quick, Joe. That's right, and I think also that what, oh, a double clothesline, and both women are down. What I was about to say, women. A uh, time limit. That, is that it? Have they called for the time limit? The referee has called. The bell has rung. It's a time limit draw. And I guess you can say that these two female gladiators met in the ring, and it's going to have to be a 